Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Candy. If you're new here, welcome. Um, so today I am going to share with you my new month goals for January. I was challenged by my niece, Sarah. Um, I will put a link to her channel right here somewhere. Um, that instead of doing New Year's resolutions like I've done for the last 40 years, for like everything you're going to accomplish in the entire year to just focus one month at a time. Like I was taught one time something about like just take one day at a time. Like when life is stressful, just worry about today. Get through today and then worry about tomorrow. And so I really like that idea of just taking it one month at a time. And so you can regroup and refocus and have a new plan for February. So I will be sharing with you my month goals for January and I invite you to also make a plan for a month goals uh, for the new year instead of year goals I mean you can do whatever you like but I think it's a really fun thing to do and you can focus more like on a small scale to build up to the big goal so obviously um, I want to lose weight I'm overweight so that's an obvious for me I want to lose weight every year I want to lose weight <laughs> but um, do I do the stuff I need to to lose weight? Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. And then I had um, a friend of mine, her daughter, posted on Instagram and it like hit me. Like it hit me hard. <laughs> and so I just try to remember this when I feel like, ugh, why can't I lose weight? And she said, so make sure you write this down. I'm going to print it out big letters and put it in this exercise room to remind me, okay? <laughs> but she said, you get what you work for, not what you wish for. Now, <laughs> I don't know why this hit me because I thought, I always wish I could be thinner. I wish I could look younger. I wish I could lose weight. But I'm not doing anything to get there. You know, I don't have a skincare routine, which I don't really care if I look younger. I am I'm, I'm the way I am. I think I'm okay. <laughs> but I would like to be healthier and I would like to get a few extra pounds off me so that my knees don't hurt so much and my shoulders and whatnot. So, I'm going to stop wishing for it, and I'm going to start working for it, and I'm going to get what I work for. If I work for it, I can achieve it. I know this. So, make sure if you're not subscribed that you subscribe so you can see this transformation. Last year, I did manage to lose weight and keep some off. I lost quite a bit. I lost about 40 pounds. But I gained a couple back and a couple back and a couple back. But I'm not back to where I started. I started at 248 and I think the other day I was 231. So I'm still down. But really, like, I feel depressed about that. Like 11 pounds or 17 pounds, whatever, in a year. I mean, it's better than nothing. But I know that I could lose 20 pounds a month. At least in the start. Because I have probably 100 to lose. I just have to work for it and stay with it. And stay focused. And so I'm hopeful that this month goal will help me and stay focused with building my strength. I know muscle burns more than fat, but I feel like I'm losing all my muscle tone because I, I've been in so much pain from my shoulders and not no strength to exercise. So we're refocused in January. I've got a list. Where's my list? Is this my list? That's not my list. Ugh. Anyways, I got a list here somewhere of physical therapy to strengthen my body and so Cody is going to be my therapist because I don't want to pay $40 a pop for a professional and she will do it for a swig, a drink from the uh, fancy little drink shop. So um, I'm going to start training and doing all those workouts and along with this elliptical back here for the cardio and I'll be posting lots of videos about that and I know I can do it. And I know you can do it. You can do anything you want. Set your mind to whatever your goals are and you can accomplish them. I believe in you. I believe in me. We can do this. We got this. And I will show you my calendar and I will see you in the next video, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to give my video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. Alright, guys. Here's my calendar. I have it hanging up on the wall in my computer slash exercise slash whatever room. Anyways, so what I've wrote here, my goals for the month or my month resolution, however you want to word it, is I plan to open an Etsy shop for my daughter's crafts 
or see about opening it because it may not be financially worth it if they charge too much. Um, if so, then we may just stick with uh, the marketplace and eBay. I'm also going to get rid of 20 pounds as well as strengthen my upper and lower limbs and my core by doing daily exercise, cardio, and lifting weights alternating days. And I plan to drink more water. Those are just the goals I want to work on for January. Obviously, I'm going to continue strengthening in following months, but that's what I want to work on for January. And then uh, spiritual goals for our family. Our family is we will be attending church every week. Right now, it's virtually, but when we feel comfortable going back to the church house, we will go there every week. We're going to start paying tithing regularly. And we're going to read scriptures nightly five times a week, at least so five times a week. And then we will be serving someone at least one time per week. Those are our spiritual goals for January. So I am super excited. I know that we can accomplish these goals. Um, I'm going to trust in my journey because life is meant to be lived. And there's always a new adventure calling. So remember, thought for the month, Jesus Christ, the same yesterday and today and forever. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you will join this challenge of doing month goals and post it. Tag me if you like. I'll be excited to see what everybody else's goals are. I was tagged by my niece, Sarah. I will put a link to her channel in here as well. She just started it. I'm super excited for her. I know she can accomplish anything she sets her mind to. Thanks guys, we'll see you in the next video. Oh.